Hey guys, it's Heather with Simply Real Life. I am outside in the backyard today. I realized I hadn't shown you guys my garden this summer of 2022, so I thought I would take you out there and show you around. It's doing actually pretty well this year, and we, for the first time ever, have gotten a couple of honeydew melons, so I had to go um, find something to prop them up so they're not sitting on the ground. So let's go take a look. Don't forget to hit the like button and follow my channel for more content. But here we are in our little garden patch back here. We actually planted two peach trees this year and we have one peach that um, is not quite ripe yet, but we had a hard freeze uh, late into March and that kind of hit a lot of our blooms hard, killed a lot of our blueberries as well. But our tomatoes have gone absolutely crazy um, we've got a lot of yellow squash back here I don't know if there's any on there right now because I just picked some the other day but oh there's a little one down there it's doing really well there's another little one down there and then we have this whole little patch over here of cantaloupe and watermelon and I was out here last night and discovered that we have two little melons. One is hiding right under there. And then one over there under those leaves. So I'm going to use these just planter pots to get them up off the ground so they don't rot and they can finish ripening. But this year. Hopefully next year we will have some more peaches. We've got lots and lots of baby tomatoes though. Alright, and on the side of the house we planted these last fall. We've got blueberries, which they did okay this year, but like Again, with the peaches, the frost really got a lot of the blooms. We did plant some strawberries. They didn't produce anything this year, but they're just getting started and they're actually doing quite well, sending out lots of runners. So hopefully those will be good for next spring. And so yeah, we did get blueberries, but just not as many as we thought we might, but they're doing well. This strawberry is going crazy. So that's our garden for this year, and hopefully next spring we'll get even more berries. Comment down below if how your garden is doing this year. I'd love to hear your tips and tricks. <laughs> 